now under 48 hours until the gates open for the Zac Brown Band concert at Stanball Stadium, believed to be the biggest concert in Youngstown history. There's a lot of work that goes into putting on a show like this. First News anchor Lauren Wood shows us the preparations that started today. You can see there's already been a lot done here at Stanball Stadium. They got started around noon, so six hours later, things look a lot different than normal. They are going to be working on this all day long. We've been dodging raindrops a little bit today, but the good news is things are looking good for Thursday. I'm joined here by Eric Ryan with JAC Live. They're, of course, the ones who brought this show to town. Eric, what exactly has happened with this transformation today? Well, the football team had practice today, and they were done at noon, and we had about 80 guys ready to go. They put down the field covering because we have to cover the field to drive the tow motors. We got 12 tow motors. We got a crane to be coming onto the field here any minute, and they've put down the deck, meaning the stage, and and they'll start erecting the roof here shortly. So they're going to work uh, about 12 hours today and then come back tomorrow and another 16 hour day tomorrow to finish up the setup. One of the best things about this concert, you were saying earlier, there's not a bad seat in the house. Tell me a little bit about how they chose where the stage was going to go. Well, we just wanted to optimize and make sure that we give people the great best experience possible. So really, putting the stage at the 50-yard line, as you can see, the stage is going to go from the 50 to the 30 to the 30 when it's all said and done, which is amazing. So uh, it's really the best setup. Uh, for the fan experience. And at the end of the day, that's what concerts are all about. People have to have a great experience where they want to come back. So, All right. Well, we are going to have all of this information for you over on WKBN.com where you can go to get tickets still for this concert on Thursday. Also information about tailgating. We even have parking info over there. So head to WKBN.com if you need any of those details. Right now in Stanball Stadium, I'm Lauren Wood, WKBN 27 First News.